right now, there is no one better on the planet than that man, the two-handed wonder from down under, Jason Belmonte. Belmo seeks to defend his PBA World Championship while also bagging his record 11th yes! major title next. Yes! It's my drug. It's I get the withdrawals if I don't do it. My first intuition of what I want to do for the day is go bowling. But um, why two hands? It's just how I started. So mum and dad built the bowling centre. I was an 18-month-old baby that wanted to bowl by himself, and the ball was a, a 10-pound ball, just too heavy for me to use. And so once I created that, that Belmo style, removing that from me became impossible. He went to a training camp once in Sydney and got to get this out of him. It's not going to do any good. Let's get him into one hand. Jason would say, but why would I want to bowl like you if I'm beating you? <laughs> Wouldn't you want to change the way I'm bowling? And then they said, oh my gosh, this is amazing. My ambition is probably be the best bowler in the world and be real rich. As a 16-year-old, I started to travel around the world. When I went to Singapore and Malaysia, I came back with, at the time, the equivalent of like $30,000 in prize money. And after I won that prize money, the very first thing I did when I got home was quit Blockbuster. And it wasn't that much longer after that, I got fired from my dad. And I said, son, I'm gonna have to let you go. <laughs> Unreliable. This is, just not, this is just not working out. <laughs> because every time he would not do his shifts, either mum or I had to do the shifts for him. So okay. it was time. Okay, and was he happy with that decision? Absolutely. <laughs> <laughs> Couldn't thank me enough. <laughs> Guess who's up next? The best on the planet, Jason Belmonte. <laughs> Time it's left standing here on the left lane. It's super stressful. And it's not just the ability to be able to do it, it's the ability to then do it 500 times in a row at a very high level. emotion came out of that man's body after that shot. He needs a strike or a spare for history. Is there such a thing as the perfect ball? I think I've already bowled it. I had a chance to break the all-time major championship record. It was the most focused that I have ever been. go of that one I had never felt it'd be that that good it was as perfect a delivery under the most intense pressure I've ever been in the best of the best bowlers around the world have only ever won 10 majors well he's up to 15 <gasps> Jason Belmonte, congratulations. Thank you very much. It's fair to say, Jason struck it rich. That international success paying for the family's modest new residence in Orange. You sit down, daddy put some syrup on it. How hard is it being away from them for such a significant portion of the year? It's the hardest part of what I do. To all of my family that have woke up at three in the morning to watch today, I love you guys so very much. Another title for the world's greatest bowler, Jason Belmonte. I'm so grateful and thankful that Kimberly in particular is just, she's amazing, but what I've achieved is, is partially Kimberly. She should hold a trophy and consider it part of hers. And um, you know, I just love it a bit for that. A 
11-year-old Hugo is already showing a deft two-handed touch. What's it like seeing Hugo bowl now? It's like a replica. Yeah, I, my heart skips a beat, actually. You know, when you see it, you just sort of look at it and it just, oh my gosh, you know. It's like you're reliving it again. A Hugo, like, you have to pull him off the lands, like I was. Look at the camera. Look at the camera. Where I am in my career right now is not where I want to be finished. I, I have so much more that I want to achieve. Um, and I want a legacy left behind that if you are going to chase it, it's the Everest of legacies. And so we're not quite there yet, but we're, uh, we're a good way up the mountain. What about the two-handed bowl? It looks so awkward and yeah. uncomfortable, but it kind of it sprung up at about mid-2000s and people were saying it's cheating, it should be a violation, but the governing body said there's nothing wrong with this. And this new technique is now being adopted by all these new players. Did I hear him call it the Belmo technique? Yeah. Is it, he's, it's named after him. His own self. All oh, right on.